so there are a lot of hard I've bought a lot of hard drives over the years I have a lot of hard drives I've done unboxings of hard drives lately uh, the hard drives I've been using for my laptop for portability I've been using the Lacy. this is a, a four terabyte firewire drive uh, and these things have been pretty good I uh, don't I still baby hard drives, even though this is shockproof and all that stuff they try to sell you on there. I always make sure to treat it like it's a, a baby, <laughs> for lack of a better. I do baby them because I I do make backups now. I have a NAS, so I just periodically, at least once a week, I just grab everything I've done during the week and dump it into the NAS to have another copy of it, and then I have a copy here. So the big thing of that is because this is a uh, with. A traditional drive I don't know if you call it a traditional it does have platters it has moving parts is what I'm trying to get out it ha it's basically like a record there's an, a not a needle but the way it, the way it reads it it spins and reads it now I have a two or three actually no I only have one now SSD drives and the SSD drives have gotten a little bit cheaper and a lot nicer the speed has even gotten faster so now I have this I have my eye on one of these for a while and Black Friday or Cyber Monday they had a good sale this is I was looking at the the, the terabyte but for now I'm gonna try this one this is a 500 so this is gonna go into my workflow as far as having the stuff that I'm working on immediately will be here and then archival will go into the bigger drive and then long-term storage goes in the NAS so I'm very, I've lost data before in the past, a long time ago, and I vowed to never again. And it doesn't take that much money to save it rather than have the heartache of losing it. So I have this now. This is SSD, so I can, I can flap it around. Don't do that. Probably don't do that. So let me go ahead and unbox this and let's take a look. I'm going to install, I'm going to format it and get it ready and get it, uh, get my workflow because I'm getting ready to make, along with this video, I'm ready to make, uh, at least two more videos today, so I wanted to crack this open and get going in this. Let's go. The great thing about this, A, it's SSD, B, look at this thing. It's tiny. It's my hand. I can hold it. The palm of my hand covers it completely. Look at that. This is so cool. You kids with your large, with your drives, you don't understand. I sound like an old man now. Now let me go ahead and crack this. Okay, take this top off and look at this. Look at that. Look at that. This is 500 gigs of SSD, super fast. It's got a USB, uh, USB C interface on there just one interface it powers off the usb itself and it comes with two options so i can do straight usb c c to c right there you probably you know what c to c looks like and what the, the way i'm going to be using it for the time being at least is usb c to the interface on the on the hard drive itself to usb a this thing i mean i don't know how to if you have the perspective of having doing this for a while, you know that this is 500 gigs this tiny. So I'm really excited about using this. Let me go ahead and turn this on, uh, format it, and get it going. There you go. Boom. That quick. Look at that. Do I want to use it as a... Do I want to use it as time machine? Under no circumstances. No. There he is. Samsung T5. I don't know how it's for. Let's see how it's formatted. It's probably NTFS. Oh, XFAT. Okay, great. I'm going to format it as journaled. That's five. Look how fast it is. You guys can't. You have no perspective over this. <laughs> That's the hard thing about talking about stuff like this. You have to kind of experience it in person to understand. That's the wrong thing. So go to full. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Applications. No, I'm in the wrong spot. Uh, utilities. Disk utility. Samsung T5. Good 
could have formatted his journal. Don't use. Okay. So here we go. Now I have 499, 499.66. Now you can't see that. 499.66. The main thing I'm going to use this for is my day to day workflow of YouTube videos because. It helps with doing 4K stuff, makes it go faster, it's a faster interface. I don't have USB-C on this, but I have it on my MacBook and I have it on my work computer. So I plan on using that to, to leverage that USB-C also because it's just a faster interface with a super fast little drive. This thing is small. I really am looking forward to using, the, using it just as much as humanly possible. So that was the Samsung T5 portable SSD. This is the uh, 500 gig version and I'm really excited to use it and thanks for watching.